We have another mini tour coming up, and this one is uh, Juliana Taylor, who is from Lubbock, Texas. She lives with her son and husband and has been collecting for 18 years or so. And she gave me her reason for starting to collect as she doesn't do jewelry or flowers. And they had to, you know, they had to be able to buy her something. And she only had 10 Pez back then. And now, well, it's more than 10. Um, when she is no longer with us all, it'll be a sad day, but her son will continue collecting her dispensers for her. So, Let's jump in and see Juliana's room. We're going to pin Juliana. Hold on, let me find. Juliana, can you unmute yourself? There we go. Yep. Okay, let me just, there we go. Okay, we see you. So when you're ready, show us around. Okay, it's going to be hard because I'm on my laptop, but here we go. Um, there's where I keep my giants. We had special made rails done for me. Then I have this shelf that is painted the raspberry pink. You can get it at Home Depot. It is an actual color. Um, all my sports are all in one cabinet so I can keep better track of them. Then I finally finish getting all the funky faces. So they're all in there together. And then there's my, where I keep all the pops, Pez. And this is just my random case. Same with that one, because I'm running out of space. And then uh, I start Juliana, going up the wall. Slow down, just slow down a little bit, because it gets a little blurry when you go fast. There you go, much better. Then I have my two mannequins that I got for Christmas last year. Well, mannequin is definitely not jewelry. What? A mannequin is definitely not jewelry. That's a fun gift to get. <laughs> and then I have the two t-shirt ones that hang up there. So I'm looking for some more. And then back over here are my is my holiday harder to see Pez cases. And then I got some over here. I got the uh, this lamp, and then I have one more on my desk full of the Pez candy. I do have a Pez comforter because uh, people do sleep in this room when they come visit. Then I have all the trucks, the Atex shadow box, and then all my other giants and box sets. And I try to do a shadow box for each convention I haven't done one for the most recent one yet because I'm out of wall space. And then here's where I put the twin packs. It's pretty full. And then the wrapping paper, I framed it all in one frame. And then that from Atex. And my most favorite Pez thing is not actually Pez, but a friend of mine that's an artist made this for me. So I had to frame it and put it above my desk. And then over here, I do have the glasses display kind of hidden in the corner. This is also just my special little shelf of don't know where to put it. So it goes up here. I love all those shadow boxes of the conventions. That's a that's a really good idea. And and other people in the comments seem to really like that idea too. Yeah, there's the second Atex one. There's that one. 
So I try to put everything that I get while I'm there in them. Um, there's Michigan. And then above the door, just to make some more space, I hung all my keychains on um, chains, just for somewhere to keep them safe. And then my husband made this so I could put these fantasy trucks on there. So, but everybody loves this comforter that I have. Oh yeah. And the mannequins, we do move them around periodically when people are in here, so. I'm looking for more. If anybody knows where I can find some more mannequins, I need a couple more. And then there's some more convention stuff that just kind of got put in there. Oh, you're blocking the, the camera a little bit. Oh, sorry. Yeah. And there's the lovely LOLs. And then there's those and I try to keep them kind of organized based on what they are but doesn't always work that well um but I'm running out of room so you can see where I've just kind of crammed them in there based on however I can get them to fit, especially in this cabinet and that second one over there. We found this glasses case at a store going out of business so I could put the cases on there. And since I ran out of room and that uh, wall hanging, the basketballs went there instead of with the sports. But this is pretty much my room. I love it, Juliana. It looks great. Um, where did you get the comforter? Society 6. Society 6 is where I ordered it. I'm looking to get um, the shower curtain so I can cover up the uh, door to here because it's glass. So that way it adds a little bit more. And here's my pops are kind of in here randomly put. Mm -hmm. I love when I see my own face in someone's collection. That's fun for me. <laughs> you're the only card I have. So you're- There I am. You're special, you, you're the only card. That's how you know I'm famous, guys. <laughs> I'm in Juliana's collection, so I did it. Um, I, I have a few non-Pez things in here. They're just special things to me. Um, this horse thing is- a friend of mine made me put him in here so that I'll never forget him. <laughs> I love that. So I love you know, when here, I've got I love like all the pins. That's great. I love when people when Pez collectors use their Pez room as a guest room, and I did it for years. Um, what, what do your guests say when they sleep in there, when they see all the glow in the dark guys? Uh, Chris Jordan really needs to know. Um, my mom is the main one that sleeps in here and she is my enabler for all the European ones. When she travels the world, she'll bring them back. So it doesn't phase her. The mannequins are the only thing that bother her. So that's why <laughs> we move them around periodically. And sometimes if I'm not paying attention, my son or husband will come in and put them right behind me. <laughs> just to scare me to death and it does work because i'll be zoned out on work stuff and seeing that out of the corner of your eye is not fun and then we made these for the ceiling fan out of two of my favorite pez pebbles oh, and nice. perry that's awesome that's a good idea but the people that stay in here say once you go to sleep you know it doesn't bother you and i slept in here for a two-week period and I didn't even realize they were really here. So it's not hard to sleep in here. I love the mannequins. I love that we as Pez collectors 
can consider buying mannequins that we have a reason to buy mannequins what a weird what a weird group we are i love it <laughs> it was just a nice way to get those displayed and the store was going out of business we just wish we would have bought more when we got them that's awesome well i hope you get many many more mannequins are I there uh, any them, but yeah me too <laughs> Are there any more questions for Juliana? We have a little bit of time if you have any questions. Thank you, Juliana. Thank you for doing a tour for us. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay.